It's a moon! Hey there, everyone, this is Alcal. And we're gonna play something here. Nachos and fried Oreos. A uh, 15, I think, exit hack that kind of has a strangely unique gimmick thing where in a world where streamers kind of expect autosave infinite lives and whatnot, this game actually has sort of this idea of lives matter. As you can see, oh, don't have access to map. I guess I'm an expert, Mario's men. So that means that I promise to start with five lives, and if I game over, then that's it. I'm gonna start over. Achieve challenge Mario to defeat his castle without game owing over in exchange for unlimited not well. That's a pretty good prize if you're into I never had fried Oreos, I think that's a real thing. Anyways, let's play that. So if I game over, like, we're gonna play around, and I'm gonna start over. I don't know what that's gonna mean for for the let us play, but... <laughs> and your file will be per erased permanently, will not receive his, his prizes, Alaska. Philodarpus's only adventures have not yet begun their quest. I haven't begun my quest yet, so I can go in the dark, mysterious zone. What's going on here? Sadistic mode. Oh! How do you... Okay. I don't know, before entering, the first one was also enable sadistic mode. No, I, I'm cool. I'm not gonna press the evil block switch, but I appreciate that it is there for me and you. Yeah, I don't really know what to expect, honestly. Nah, Alright, there's nothing else. I put an expert. Let's see what, what happened goes, man. Big spot here in the map. Rainbow shoe starting off. Yeah, okay. oh, see, it's disco on disco violence. Ain't no shoes here. So there are lives to be won. Oh, this is, this is the shell level. So the has, has a moon and five dagadons. Then we'll regain your rarvis on your current difficulty level. Okay, so that's pretty rad. So yeah, so you still have like a uh, look, look, look here shell. All right. So you see, oh, but they're like in weird, awkward spots though. Got it. Okay. All right. Get out of here, Disco. Come to the temple of Zanzibar. He will not show up, though, so don't make any promises. You can't eat. All right. So this is a level of shells. People are killing shells everywhere. Dang it. I got hurt by the Disco shell that is everywhere. It's one disco shell repeated at nauseam. Good for you. Oh no, Charlie was destroyed by disco. What the? Whoa. Um. Yeah, I'm not sure why I was leaning to the left there all that much. I I don't feel like it's something I tried to do. <laughs> Uh, I do not have any excuses nor explanation. It just happened. Oh my god, so much coop of violence. Like, we all gotta learn to live in peace, man. Alright, you get out of here. Uh, well, um, it's not too late. I can make them reappear. Or I can do the jump from there, probably, too. Like, it's... Oh, I just got it from the lower guy. Stop panicking all the time, man. See, by destroying that guy, I destroyed that guy. <laughs> wow, I can't believe you could do such a thing. Discovering new limits in video games. I don't know what I'm saying. Alright, destroy the disco. Bop that guy. Feel good about yourself. Do the jump without realizing you were going to do it because, yeah, that, that's kind of high. You gotta, like, you gotta know what you're doing and you gotta do what you do. I, so I went in like, yeah, like the difficulty changes like your lives. I don't think there are any other changes. Like, I don't think it's gonna like alter the gameplay. I'm sure that people would be allowed, like allowed, able to do something like that. Oh man, we just got ourselves a little reloading platform for our little friend though. Uh, hi. So, oh, geez, this is dangerous, guys. Like, what are you guys doing? Oh shoot, that's not where I want to be. Well, can I just bounce back up? Thank you. Eh! Yeah, I want to get that E. Eh, all right. Eh. Quiet. Charlie, stop. Oh, jeez. Yeah, no, yeah, I panicked a little bit. Just a little bit. That's just, okay, yeah. Disco on, disco shells. 
All right, probably worth it. Oh, three lives! Well, 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 I'm not big, so I can't get no moon. Your game- oh, an automatic save. Okay, whenever you move around or your life count changes, which is insane. Alright, well, got it then. And if you can get here big- okay, so no score. No star score. If you get can get here big, then I could get a moon. But, I mean, I got the Yoshi coins. I didn't expect three lives. I got myself a big old walnut here, a big old prophet. Let's keep going in the universe. Mouthful of cactus. Please don't have that happen to you. In this world, you will be unable to pause if you are jumping. So you can pause if you're on the ground. But yeah, if you're doing something else, you can't. Okay, makes sense. I see the line. Well, yeah, I got hit there. I was having trouble negotiating that jump, and we saw the result. Eh. Wow. It's like you almost have to do that on purpose to land on that th Yeah, I don't know, I'm having some issues with like, micro landing here. My just, like, re getting reacquainted with uh, SNES 9X. Like it has a little bit of a frame delay, right? And uh, I've been playing a game that did not, and yeah, I think it's just like, just getting reacquainted with that. It's fine. It's good. We're gonna be okay. So getting Dagadons, absolutely worth it, unless you think you're gonna lose three lives getting one. But if you think you're only gonna lose two, really, I'm surprised that that caused that. Whoa! I got ambushed! That fireball! Okay, um, so, will that tiny... Huh, well that's a good way to learn their weird movement. <sighs> Again, yeah! Here we are. That is really, uh, dang it. So, yeah, I was maybe too, oh, you don't get there. Oh, it's for this guy, got it. Yeah, my, my only thing is that, is that these seem to pop pretty aggressively. Like, and when you're kind of, uh, dude. And sometimes, uh, yeah, okay, I don't know why I went with a spin jump there. Whoa, hi cactus. Whoa, hi cactus. Hey. Hey, Cactus. Everyone's just cactusing tonight, man. Calm down the Giuseppes, please. Alright, so. You're a cannon. You are also a cannon. You're a cactus ball. It's almost like a cannon. It's not at all like a cannon. Uh, yeah, I got shot at. Like, that thing just aims at me, man. It just wants me down. It just wants me dead. Shoot up there! Ah, uh, that thing. It's just it's so violent. Yeah, okay, well, um, I'm back into more lives than at the start of the game, but this is, uh, pretty hard, uh, in terms of, like, level construction, like, not unfairly so, but still, like, it surprises me. Okay, so, uh, like, this could just be a regular Mario hack. And it would still be something. Okay, so then I go here. You're gonna throw you. I'm not gonna know what to do. Ah, shoot. You throw from off screen. I think that's what's throwing me off. Enemies don't do that normally in this game. So, like, it's weird having to accommodate for a, like, a guy you can just barely see on the edge of existence. It's enough to throw me off a little bit. That's a cannon. See, cannons are well behaved. They throw their projectiles in a straight line. And, uh, it's not- it's too dangerous to go back for it. I might regret this. I'm already kinda... Where did I die last time? Around here? Ugh. Don't shoot at me, Cactus. You're not allowed. You don't have a Mario hunting license. Yet, yeah, still. Here's the end! Who's that guy? Yeah, I did it! I bounced on this projectile! Oh, this is serious! Oh, wow, really? Okay, there's a way to do this, and it's probably worth it. Yeah! Two up. <laughs> what? What? I get more lives from Dagadon from the moon! <laughs> what? I guess that makes sense, because for the Dagadon, 
You need to get five pieces. For the moon, I just need to get one piece. I see the logic. Oh man, this is, this is exciting. El Pogo Loco. Here we go, Crazy Pogo, the. Yeah, it's that guy. He's bouncing along like a truck. Blue equal bounce, yellow spin jump, red do not touch. Okay, oh, 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 some pogo guys have stronger pogo stacks, so they will bounce higher. Other people just do what they want. So blue is bounce. Blue is bounce. Bounce on that guy and become a friend. That's how that works. Still in the blue carry. So yeah, we got. Oh, so this one's got a big shining A. Because you gotta bounce on it. Here it says it wants you to be leaving yourself. I just missed the guy entirely. I hope that's okay. They are strewn about the neighborhood. Dang it. What? E to this. Like, they are time in a really wacky way. I, I wouldn't have made. Uh... Can here get a one? Yeah, red don't touch. Just don't interact with. Red is trouble. Red is trouble. <laughs> I wanted to bop block on it and say red is dead, but uh, I broke the block. I broke it. Sorry, I wasn't careful with it. Okay, this is kind of neat though. I like how they move. It's super weird. This is just yeah. I um I did that wrong. <laughs> that's that's this is all there is to it. Like, I kind of want a Dagon, but Ugh. I jumped too early. Like, I realize I could probably do a better effort at trying to time there, but I don't know, man. I'm not. <laughs> like, what else can I say? <laughs> Alright, so then, yeah, here we get Red Zone. They're just kind of doing their thing here. Okay, there we go. That's just how you do that. Yeah, I did it! Alright. I get to A bounce on this guy, but like, yeah, I need to be. Whoa, I'm happy how all that plant pan. Fan and an and an and Very happy about that. Like, those timings are so tricky. Oh, one shot. Ah! Did it. One shot's all I need, friend. That doesn't look too bad. Oh, what? I can't. Okay. <laughs> like, I first touched the grass and it just didn't do anything. I guess it's just my up, oh, man. You gotta hold up and uh, up did it. Oh, look at that. I start with five, I end with ten. Profit after three levels. I am getting such an amazing vibe from this. These are really fun level. It's kind of very scary, though, because... Hives are scary, and I have to assume it's just gonna get harder, right? Beautiful map, by the way. Uh, it's really complex. People build very specific bridges.